everybody to our connection guides talking about the different ways you can connect hardware to your new line display panel. We are looking, of course, at the left side of one of our panels here. You can see all of the different connection ports. So tune into some of the other videos where we've talked about your HDMI connection. Now we're actually going to talk about USB-C connection. So your USB-C is just this little guy down here on the bottom. Of course, you have uh, potentially front options as well, uh, but we're talking about these side options. So this USB-C port is your bottom port. If you're unaware of what USB-C connections look like, they actually look like this. So it's just that nice little oval. Let me get back so you can kind of see it a little bit better. Uh, really nice when you are using USB-C connections, you're just going to need the one cable to transfer everything back and forth. So USB-C will transfer the audio, the visual, and the touch capability between your computer and our panel. So really, really handy. For this, all you're gonna need to do is take one end of the USB. We are gonna plug it into this Type-C port down here on the bottom. And of course, depending on your panel, you may have an optional Type-C port on the front of your panel, um, works the same way. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the other end of this USB-C and just plug it into my computer. So now with this one cord, I'm able to transfer again, audio, visual and touch all with just one cord, a little bit newer technology so it can do some different stuff. But you should have received this cord in your new line panel accessories kit. And there you go. That's how you get connected with USB-C between your new line panel and your device. Reach out with any questions. We look forward to hearing from you and we'll talk again soon. Take care.